Good morning, everybody. Cinnamon's outside. We are gonna go to do another grocery store haul. Cause I didn't get hardly anything last time, even though my bill was like over a hundred, but. Go. So I'm pretty much all ready. I'm gonna go grab my keys. And my wallet, and we're gonna go. It's kind of rainy. I'm gonna wear my Wally's today. My Wally Hey Dudes. I did not leave the house at all yesterday. So let's go get some groceries. In my mind is the same old. Go and shut the window. While they say they go where they go. I think I'm too old for some things. And I know I'm just a ghost. And they play around for these days. That's why I can't change. I need to get um, coffee, Gatorade, all kinds of stuff. Oh, it's Thursday, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome back to a whole other vlog. We can turn that air down. It's not even that cold this morning. But got my water. So we're gonna go ahead and get going and go to the store. It is 8.18 a.m. I'm happy I got my butt home moving. <laughs> Cause to be honest with you, I did not want to move this morning. I just wanted to stay in bed all day. And that's my option. So let's get going to Target. <laughs>
my songs And I know it's sad to say I'm fast asleep when I'm in pain I feel it all the same And everything's the same I'm looking for peace of mind You don't know how much time I've been burning through Just pulling over pages Seem to change, you know I'll never say it I don't think that things are getting better But I don't know Still I can hope it's getting late It's where I won't care about things that you I'm looking for peace of mind You don't know how much I'm I actually had a coupon, so I actually saved two dollars. It must have been saved in my Target circle. I think it was probably for <coughs> either the milk or the coffee, because I usually never have anything on me. Gatorade, and it's pouring down rain out here, literally. And this one lady is so freaking out of it. She's walking and. The guy like driving almost hit her because she just like doesn't even pay attention to what she's even doing. And it's just like, yeah. People are freaking nuts. My phone's almost dying though, so we gotta plug. Okay, so we're in the car. We're done. It was $70. And my leather wallet literally got ruined by this rain. Look at it. I really hope it dries this was a really really nice wallet and I did not want it to be ruined so I hope it dries after I get home or so but okay let's go home the worst part getting out of the car and getting all the groceries sounds like fun doesn't it I have my ventilated seat on girl so nice because like I'm coughing with the air conditioner <coughs> but the seat I'm not so that's why I have the seat on okay unplug y'all let's go We're charging for our time lapse so y'all can see where are we going? Um, and now we're gonna get all of our groceries and stuff, which I don't have a lot, but it's a lot of like big stuff, so. But we can get rid of the milk automatically by putting it down here. Can we get some lights on in here? The motion detector thing ain't even picking me up. Oh, there it goes. About time. Okay, so the Swiss little half gallon can go down here in this fridge. Then the rest can go up into my fridge. Where can I put her milk? Right there. Looks like it will fit right, ooh, right there. Okay, now let's get all of my stuff. It's nine o'clock now. So I'm gonna go my stuff in the house and I'll see you guys up there. Okay guys, we're home. Don't mind my counter. I'm not happy about her. I burnt this on my counter. It won't come off, but. You know what, you guys can barely even see it. We're back to Target. We got two dark roast Starbucks iced coffees. I got three big bottles of the berry flavor Gatorade. They don't have this in the small ones, but I love this flavor. And then I got two things of cream cheese, Good and Gather brand. And then I got two packs of Oscar Mayer thick cut bacon. 
it's not really that much thicker cut and you get more bacon for the money actually in the long run. I figured it out. So quick tip, get the thick cut, you save some money because you get a lot, you get the same amount of slices of bacon all but like one slice and each slice is a lot thicker. So it's a lot better. So get that unless you don't like the thick cut. And then I got a caramel macchiato international delight creamer. And then I got a big gallon of regular milk for the house here upstairs. And I got a eight pack, two eight packs of grape zero Gatorade. And I got a eight pack of the Glacier Freeze zero sugar Gatorade. I like the zero sugar. It is so much more healthier. So let's stock up the fridge with all our stuff. I'm gonna attempt to move you guys. That way y'all can get a, a much better view of my key fob. I'm just went down my sink. Give me a second to reply to a text. Yes. Okay. Um, so, y'all can see the fridge. Um, I'm gonna stock up some Gatorades then. Get my milk. make some breakfast this morning but my kitchen's clean I don't want to dirty my kitchen from like two days ago. Still good. Get in the fridge. I don't want this. I don't know how old it is. Okay. Now, I'm gonna load one, two, Glacier Freeze, and this one just, I think, scored it on me. I didn't, I don't know. I thought I felt something. I hope all eight of these fit. They should, yeah, they're gonna fit. I can actually fit a few more, so I should do that. I can't, that's it. We're full. Okay. Now the rest of these Gatorades can go on the floor. But Gatorade is my go-to when it comes to drinks because they're zero sugar, they taste good. They don't put up your blood sugar even though I'm not a diabetic. I don't want to have diabetes, so it's so good to not have any sugar in them. I don't care what the side effects are of everybody going nuts over sucralose and all that. 
and Fenny Leoline. I don't like that Fenny Leoline garbage. It tastes terrible, but the sucralose is not bad at all. You can't even taste a difference. Um, and I'll be honest with you, there are side effects of all your medications that your doctor has you on too, but you don't care about that one. Yeah. So it's either deal with the side effects of having stuff that's made with sucralose, which is zero sugar, or deal with the side effects of your medication once you're a diabetic and you're on all these medications and insulin and all this garbage and you have to pop a pill every single day and then you feel like crap because your pill, like the metformin, makes you have diarrhea. And trust me, even if you're on the pill for a few, year, for a few years, that metformin, you will never be the same. Okay, that metformin destroys you. My mother was on that, my grandfather was on that, it was pure hell. Um, it caused them to sleep all the time. My mother actually never picked me up from school one day because she fell asleep and she just like, it, she wouldn't get up. She didn't know what time it was. Like, you know, because of the student metformin. So it's like, instead of worrying about the little bit of a side effect of so-called scientific evidence that people have found from sucralose, Maybe it's just called that diabetics drink a lot of zero sugar stuff. So the sugar lows has a different effect on them because they've been drinking, they've been taking their medication. Maybe it's truly their medication. I don't know. I don't believe all that garbage. I drink whatever I want and I really just don't even care um, except for the sugar. The natural stuff that I know what does, you know, all this like little like scientific evidence of what sugar and all this other stuff. I really just don't care. The only thing really sugary I drink is this and soda. But most of the time I'm drinking a Gatorade Zero, especially whenever I'm outside doing work. It's lit on your stomach. It's good. I love it. I don't care. I know people are gonna be hammering me in the comments, so I'm sure, because I drink Gatorade Zero. I just wanna talk about it because I know people are going nuts over zero sugar and how it's bad for you and artificial sugar's garbage and blah, blah, blah. It's like, you know, some people require that that's better, way better than having a whole bunch of sugar and being a lifelong diabetic with this illness that is totally 100% pure hell to live with. So I don't care. You enjoy all your sugar. When you got diabetes at 80 years old or 45 years old, 50 years old, and you're living through hell like my mother and my grandfather, then you enjoy that because I don't want it. And I'll do whatever it takes not to get it. And if I do get it, I'm gonna attempt to turn around with a full remission if it's early enough, which that, that's possible too. People say that's not true, but per the CDC, that one's true. So once again, I don't care. I believe what I wanna believe and you are entitled to your opinion. So always remember that when you come here, you're always entitled to your opinion. And that's why I'm giving my opinion because I want people to know how I feel upon these topics, but you're always entitled to your own. And some people may not like Gatorade Zero, but you don't have to bash me for it. And I'm not gonna bash you for not liking Gatorade Zero, even though I do. So there you go. But this coffee was from the 8th, it's the 10th. It was from two days ago when I went to the mall, if you guys saw that vlog yet. It's not up yet, I have to put it up, but you guys will see it after this one or before this one. So when I went to the mall, I got this coffee. And if you remember, I was like, ew, I don't want it, but I'm drinking it now, it's good. So must've been my whole mood that day, but that was pretty much it for today's vlog. Um, I went to the grocery store and that's pretty much all I have planned for the rest of today. Um, I got my groceries. I might make some breakfast, but I may not. I may just have one of these glazed donuts and call it a day. Um, but that's pretty much it for today's video. Um, don't mind the stash of all my snacks. It's just a mess. I don't have it organized, but even if I organize them, people come and they rush through and like smash everything all up. So I leave it messy. You grab what you need. You can find it. I know where everything's at. I, I'm just ready for people to bash because I know people always be bashing everybody else. And that pisses me off to no end. I don't care what like your opinion is, but like I don't you don't have to share it to every single person and bash everyone all because their house is dirty or something or all because their storage shelving is not in order or all because they drink coffee or all because they look musty. 
I mean, come on, people have other problems, but it's a rainy little day. I got my groceries, they're in the house. I spend 70 some dollars, so now total, that puts us like $200 that we've spent at Target for groceries so far. So I'm not done yet. That was just two shops. We have more to go. Um, Cause I know we're have near enough food still after those shops. But um, anyway, that's it you guys. So have a good day. I forgot my vinegar. I forgot vinegar. That's okay. I got the main things. So thank y'all for coming along with me shopping. Have a great day and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.